All right, here we go. Alright, game... Oh my god, yeah. This song needs to stop. It's too much. Alright. Grand Finals. Rematch between Mouse Rat and uh, C. Caleb. This was a very nail-biter set in, uh, in Winners. So, I, like, like these aren't going to be fast, but there, there's going to be a lot of interactions. They're just, they're just not going to individually amount to a lot, but uh, in the long run, like things are going to go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Um, so like, oh, as we can see, already a minute has passed, and uh, you know, Mouse Rat's at 88, and Caleb's at 45. So like, not too much damage. I, Interesting that they ended up starting on Battlefield. So, like, you know, this is a stage where people are uh, will live longer because bla the blast zones on Battlefield are huge. Uh, but, you know, you have all this mobility uh, given by the platforms for Pikachu and honestly even for Pac-Man because, like, yeah, while he, can, while he can't, like, air camp his uh, hydrant from anywhere because of, the hydr uh, because of the platforms, it still is great when he's like under a platform and you can't come in from the side or the top. What do you do? He's just gonna charge. I, I keep getting like the slow jazzy, the, well not jazzy, but just like the slow music when, he's, when they're, they're playing and uh, I'm about it. Cause this is on shuffle. What we get is just what we get. Like yeah, I can right, swap I'm, it, but this fits. I'm here, Devin. I'm here to help. Hello. Hi, How are you? Made myself another drink, so we're in, we're in deep for the long haul. Yeah, we're gonna, you're gonna need one. Uh, so here we are. Uh, UBL Soul joining me for this grand finals. Oh yeah, we're here for the we're here for the Pac-Man gameplay. I'm surprised that he's going Pac on uh, Battlefield since he counterpicked Gunner on the previous tripod of Yoshi. So even though they are functionally different mid stage. I well, think he want to keep to the same game plan, which is mostly hanging out on this top platform. I think he might have wanted to do such a thing, but since this was game one, they're in strike, so I had no characters ahead of time. I don't know how they ended up striking here, though. That would be the question. Yeah. Especially Tika, who like doesn't have as many of the longer uh, horizontal strings on Battlefield, which is kind of the big thing, because you, you want to get those edge guards on Pac-Man. You want to get them off stage. You want to get them to commit to larger buttons than he has to on stage. I think Mousetrap might be doing it for the, uh, the evasion bonus he gets from like a stage like this, being Pikachu with all of those platforms. He's just like, try and catch me, idiot. You know? <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> imagine if Pikachu could edge cancel in this game. Oh, Crazy. I don't want to imagine that. He's already... <laughs> he's good enough. <laughs> stop, stop. He's already too good. Yeah. It's like, let's... <laughs> if Pikachu's the army and they're like, give him a gun. It's like, no! <laughs> what do you got there? A knife. Stop! Ah. Anyway, so three minutes on the clock here, and uh, Caleb is at 134 damage. If Mousetrat's able to seal out this uh, stock without taking too much more damage, honestly, even a little bit more wouldn't hurt because of the blast zones on Battlefield. Yeah, and th I guess this is the situation where Pikachu is very much glad he has a kill throw, but yeah, on Battlefield, it's going to not be... Yeah, it's going to be tough. Maybe now, with a little bit of rage, maybe, maybe he kills now, but... I, that's, a, that's a hard maybe. I don't see him looking for anything other than uh, like his safe F smashes on ledge and T jolt to dash attack. Other than that, we know that he's perfectly content with playing the clock. And he's like, look, man, if you want me to two stock you with a timeout, by all means. 
you know? Oh, yeah. And these percents are neck and neck now. I really love the fact that, like, even though, uh, like, Mouse Ride is so passive, uh, even with the lead, C. Caleb just doesn't, like, change his game plan. He's just like, okay, I'll just move my game plan forward, you know? I don't, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stop playing to my character's strengths and up, up throw gonna finally do it, like you said. Yeah, it just needed a little bit more rage on there. But I do, I do like that kind of idea where uh, Caleb is a stock down, and so instead of putting his wall in mid stage, he's gonna put it at three quarter stage and try and keep Pikachu a little bit more pinned as much as you can. Uh, okay, an elongated edge guard. He could have gotten the spike there, which is a little too late. Yeah. Still, uh, racked on some pretty meaningful damage. Sixty damage. Uh. A 60 damage is lead when there's like less than a when there's almost a minute left on the clock. Like th this probably will go to time given how large the blast zones are. We're about to hit the one minute mark and uh, you know Mouse Rat has a near hundred percent lead. Oh Yeah, he just needs to He's been doing it a couple times in the previous set, but he needs to be a little bit more careful when approaching Pac-Man on ledge, especially when he has a Galaga like he does right now, because that's a one false move and you get another 50 on you. And while it's not enough to surpass now, it could have been a couple couple mm -hmm. seconds earlier. Yeah. All right, 40 seconds on the clock, and really, uh, Caleb hasn't been able to get a single hit in. So this is looking really good for Malstrad. I, I, you know, 30 seconds, it's over. And the dash deck's going to have to seal it out anyway. So, game one going to Mouse Rat. A testament to how safe Pikachu can really be and yeah. still apply pressure just by the threat of, man, if I throw this apple or whatever item he has uh, too soon, then uh, he could get quick attack punished. He could get caught by a dash attack as the killing screen shows. Mm -hmm. uh, and how potent Pikachu is still in the meta where he can adapt to characters that need to be rushed down and killed early, like pa uh, like Palutena or Joker, or he can slow the pace down and take his time against characters like Pac-Man. Yeah, that's really the gift of the fact that like he's a fast character but also has a projectile, so like he can harass, but like he can slow down if he needs to, and just like he's really just open to any situation you know so mouse rat definitely and mouse rat himself as a player is just uh, very passive so pikachu allowing him to like uh play to those strengths oh yeah yeah it's it's amazing how much like pikachu is kind of infamous for being just so inc like the majority of the high tiers like pikachu is their worst matchup and it's it's a show of how you can kind of play a character to be any any kit you can play pikachu to be any characters where it's matchup yeah but you know as if we'd seen anything out of caleb throughout these uh it's been five six this is now the seventh game they've played uh he's patient he's willing to wait <laughs> yeah we didn't see the timeouts until the last three games of their best of five so this is now the fourth Basically, timeout. <laughs> yeah. We're really running the clock. Yeah. Clock is sweating, honestly. Just sees these guys like, oh, God, I really got to go all the way down. I'm, I have a family to get home to. <laughs> it's the clock's, like, calorie day. He's really working it. Yeah. Like, trying to trying to burn off some of those seconds. Uh, truthfully. <laughs> all right. So, uh... Caleb's counter pick is FD, which makes sense because like, like you it. have like free reign for the hydrant. Although I don't really know how much the hydrant really plays in this matchup. I feel like it's it's both a boon and a detriment because yeah. while yes you get to block T jolts, you're also pinning your pinning off your own aggression uh, by way of setting up the hydrant to be a wall. You're functioning Ooh. as a as a wall. Yeah, it's an obstacle. All right. Same thing with that trampoline right there. Risk free jumping ledge. Yeah, it's always it's kind of interesting how the usage of the trampoline gets, or the nuisance factor of the trampoline gets put into use mm -hmm. on how it also blocks T jolts, but also prevents just askew quick attacks and run-ins. You just have to 
you have to play Pac-Man's minigame. Yeah. You have to play Pac-Land to get to fight Pac-Man. And, and no one wants to pay Pac-Land, all right? No, no, no. Whoa! He was actually above the thunder. And then uh, was able to pretend that he himself was also Zeus and sent down the hydrant instead. Yeah, just playing the throw this off the mountain. Pac-Man playing God. Mountain Olympus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the truest Pac God. All right. Uh, all right. One eighty-two. Making full use of that stock. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Like. Okay. Wait a minute. He's gonna keep it going. Yeah, like, approaching Pac-Man with Galaga is, it's rough, because you're basically resigning, it's like a resigning to a Peach combo. Yeah. But you're just running straight at Peach while they're down tilting. It's like, well, wait a minute. <laughs> uh, uh, not close enough to get anything off that bell. Lo-fi beats to watch this timeout to, I <laughs> kind of love it. Four minutes on the clock. Honestly, I feel like they've made more progress than usual. <laughs> I mean, I would say that, but also Caleb's still at his first stop. He is. Uh, when, when is, once we hit 350, we're at the half time. When is Pikachu at half of his stock? Is it now? I think it's now. Okay, so. Maybe a little bit more, cause like, yeah. he's been getting a lot more mileage out of each stock. Oh my god, up god. air killed. When up air kills, <laughs> you know the percents are too high. Yeah. Oh my god, that hydrant angle. Pac-Man has such silly uh, ways of like launching the hydrant. I think for a good while in Smash 4 and Ultimate, whenever I would watch Sinji or another good Pac-Man yeah. play, it, I'd learn something new about Pac-Man every time. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. Oh, for sure. All right, this is a really, really good situation for Caleb right now. Like a full stock 40%. lead in this gameplay? Oh, my. Man, it's just like commitment to not wanting to deal with Pikachu's shenanigans. He's going to nair and ju or jump out of shield and say, you're approaching and you're interacting with me on my terms only. Yeah. I, Not yours. And so maybe, like, I guess uh, to what I said earlier, uh, like, even though I might not see, like, the full advantages of, like, just just being FD, it, like, it, it, the results are showing it. So, like, this is working out very well uh, for, for Caleb. So... I, I, this, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if this is the last time we see this stage with just how well things are. But, I mean, I guess uh, if Nazareth's able to get a kill, like, there's still... <laughs> God, how many times I'm going to be like, but there's still X amount of time on the clock. Like, we could see a kill. That, that timer is elusive in how it functions, and that could have been a drag down, nair down smash, but he threw that away. Oh my, One wow. more? One more for the fans? The bell okay. right through the stage. Yeah, this is slipping away ever, ever so slowly. And it, I guess it makes sense, oh. like, why the FD pick is working, because Mouse Rat has augmented his game plan to be, oh, if you're going to use Hydrant as a wall and try and stay behind it and use that to... Uh, to get away from my T-Jolt pressure, then I'll use the Town and City platforms or the Battlefield platforms or whatever sort of extra thing there is to use to get around you. Now there's not that. So you just have to keep jumping. <laughs> and Caleb has caught almost every jump over the hydrant with any sort of fair or nair or back air. And sooner or later, these back airs are going to kill. Ooh, that's strong. Chat. 
22 seconds left. This is gonna have to be some crazy of a back air string. Okay, okay, you know. Cute, didn't go the right way. And he dies for it, 10 yeah. seconds on the clock, that's still a timeout. I don't wanna hear it. <laughs> yeah, practically. Yeah, all right, so we had five timeouts in a row as far as these guys have fought. I'm making my shots now. Yike Rooney. One for every timeout. Yeah, I see that uh, Brady has started a poll that if, uh, we should uh, run an ad. Um, we can. Is, is this the poll where you can stuff ballots, or is it just literally just one each? <laughs> what ad? I must uh, I don't even know how you check for something like that. I cannot vote again, so... Okay, so no ballot stuffing. Unfortunate. That's so funny that that's even an option. You can just keep voting. Go ahead. It's fine. You know, it could have been crazy if that thunder sent the other way. Uh, but, alas. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No more... We don't live in what-if situations in any sort of fighting game. You have to put that behind you and move on to the next timeout. Gunner. Okay, so this makes me think Yoshi's town. Like, Mouse Rat doesn't play anyone else. He, he plays Pikachu. All right, so like, do I do the period. commercial now, or? Ooh, let's see, hold on. Yes. All right, there we go, perfect. There you guys go. Enjoy. 30 second ad break. Let's go. Man, I kind of. Oh! Oh, we're seeing, uh. The, uh, the. the this matchup on stage again, so. Yoshi's story with uh, the what? What is a uh, sketch been calling her Jane Wick? Perfect. Yeah, Jane. Jane Wick. <laughs> it's pretty good. I find it kind of incredible that you know on a stage that most players <gasps> consider a small stage option. It's good. I mean, Caleb has had good shield discipline this entire. X yeah. number of games. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but as for the stage that everyone considers like, oh, it has the slants and it's a little bit smaller blast zones and it's a tri-plat layout. So it's kind of leading everyone to believe that it's a it's a CQC kind of stage. Like yeah. it's about it's about interacting, it's about edge guarding, it's about using the walls, all of that extra stuff. Caleb says no, no, no. For you see, I am me Gunner. I am the Jane Wick. And yeah. We'll be here for seven minutes. <laughs> have you seen my stealth blast? Oh, you have oh! no idea. There, there it was. <laughs> boom, boom. Okay, wait. That was kind of cute. All right. Don't jump. He, he did it. He jumped. <laughs> At least it's not like the really right. lame boys. We're really on our first stock still. Oh, tried to stealth blast. I'm still trying to decide if stealth blast is good or not. Well, what is uh, what are the other options? It's charge shot. It's um, the grenade launch, and oh, that... then it's stealth blast, I believe. Like those are the three neutral specials. I, I don't know if a charge shot would be that useful in this matchup, but the grenade, oh, that grenade's, that grenade's so pretty good. good. But I mean, Kale's making real good use of the self blast. So. Oh wait, no, he no. has the charge shot. So okay. then, what is which move what is, is side it? B? What is? I think self it's is side B. Down. Okay, I know the. I think it's side B because the grenade 
the grenade drop is down B for sure. Okay. He has the arcing up B without a hitbox, so it has to be side B. Okay. Okay, so if it's side B, then what are the moves? Uh. Um. Whatever. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, honestly. Uh, oh, it's it's um it's flame pillar. I think is one of them. Oh, flame pillar missiles and um this. and stealth blast. The flame pillar is pretty good. Yeah, it's good for ledge trapping. The missiles are super spammable, but they're probably not as safe as they would be in most other matchups. I I love how so yeah, maybe. Uh, Caleb just hangs on the edge, being like, "Oh yeah, try all your ledge tricksies. You can't hit me." Yeah, it's <laughs> it's kind of crazy how a lot of the Pikachu counterplay is just to wait, wait. until he's done pressing buttons. Yeah. <laughs> That's what he has in common with Ness. It's just like, just look at him, just whatever. He's just, he's gonna tire himself out. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. So can I do anything about that? No. Just Pikachu. Just 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 let him, just let him do his thing. If you try himself out eventually. Yeah. If you try to do anything about it, you're gonna get yourself hurt. Oh. Have a good there one, Dan the Man. Register for next week. Have a good night, y'all. Anyone that's leaving. Habibi. Alright, charge shot. What is this song? I don't know. It's Bomberman. Ah, okay. Ugh. That makes, you know what, that makes sense. All right, yeah. so that up till it works. Caleb evening it up. Minute fifty. This is this might go to zero instead of just an honorary timeout. We might see the the real deal. Yeah, the good the, shit. Yeah. No more teases <laughs> with the zero zero zero. Honestly, um, are there any any uh, VGM? soundtracks that are like heavy metal because I think that'd be really funny <laughs> with how slow they're playing but like it's just like the, the you know the fastest music you can think of you know oh you know what uh, the, oh doom music, like yeah, that music. wait no I I, uh, I, I, doom, I have yeah. no no I have, I have a better one extreme G3 that racing music yes <laughs> Hold on. Yes. I got you. Enjoy the silence. Oh my god. Oh yeah. It's this is my shit. <laughs> is he dead, really? He is. Wow, he died. Oh my god. I didn't think that was that strong. Especially from like low state. There we go. Play all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're not gonna you're not gonna be able to hear it. Well, I guess I you know what? No, I can't. I can uh I can put it in the music bot. <laughs> so let me let me uh get in there. Time for the everybody. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Oh, I have to balance your the audio so hard now. <laughs> oh, hold on. There we go. Discord was doing this annoying thing where I can't change the volume until I leave and come back. There we go. Discord call settings are like restrictive sometimes. Yeah. And then you can come back in and have full access. Yeah. All right. Also, we went back to Yoshi's. We did. Did I update the score? Is it 1-1 one, one or? It's 2-1 um, Caleb. 2-1 Caleb, thank you. I got distracted. 
Oh, wrong it's one. Okay. Wait. Oh, they switch sides. It's Brady. There we go. <laughs> I guess it's. Is it harder to catch me Gunner's landings as opposed to Pac Man's? Like, is that a legitimate. Say the question again? Is it harder to catch me Gunner's landings thanks to things like the uh, bomb drop and uh, any sort of. Oh, I'm not sure. That they got going on compared to Pac Man, who has things like Hydrant and just in general really fast aerials. Like, I'm trying to think what makes me Gunner a better pick on this stage compared to Pac-Man, who's arguably one of Pikachu's, uh, maybe not like hard losing, like Ness or mm -hmm. Game & Watch, but one of Pikachu's harder matchups. Oh, just get absolutely caught. That is, that's been that's been kind of a, a trick throughout the these several games is not only the the passiveness that we're making a joke of now, but like every time Mouse Rat jumps out of shield or tries to quick attack the center, like Caleb's there with a with a hitbox. Like he's there with a buff. I can't focus on this like this like heavy like EDM music, race music. Oh, it's hype. <laughs> I'm raging right now. So like the harder the harder it goes in, the more ironic it gets, which just fuels me. Honestly. <laughs> I caught him. Caught him jumping. Cause everybody jumps out of shield this game. Oh. Is this stock? He didn't go for the dare? Come on. That was free. You had him air dodging. Like mouse pad, you you can play this slow game, but at the end of the day, like if you, all you're getting is Pikachu's like yeah. really basic bread and butters, which are doing 30 to 40, which is good, but he keeps sniping you with charge shots and these bombs, and you're already at a huge disadvantage, huge deficit. Like you need to start going for some of these hail marys. Yeah, you can. He's like getting better at the keep away. Like we've seen so, like before things were getting really, really close with the, even uh, without the timeouts, even though they were timeouts anyway. But like we've seen like full stock leads now. So like it, Caleb is just kind of like adapting to just the movement game that Maltrite is going for. It's not as uh, impenetrable. It's not like it's not a rock and a hard place. Both trying to. Just push each other. He's he's really beginning to just like know where the ins and outs are. Yeah, his pickaxe is uh, starting to break. He's gonna need to upgrade it. Haha, -ha, Steve. Haha. Haha. Haha, Minecraft. Haha. -ha. I don't actually like Minecraft all that much. I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> don't think it's very fun. Eh. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, yeah, it's totally subjective. I'm just thinking about it, and I'm, I've had two. I I've played two it when it was in beta. So. Uh, out of a pint glass so far. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah, that's a long time ago. A couple friends of mine were like, Whoa. "Man, they only made his arm. They only made his upgrade up to a diamond. What about netherite?" And it's just I, just, I muted them immediately. Yeah. <laughs> I uh, when I saw his up in this game, I was like, "What the hell is that?" Why can he glide again? We don't need gliding in this game. Oh. You should no, 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 no. They gave him frog glide. It's He's gonna go <laughs> under the stage. It's gonna be mad annoying. Yeah, I wonder if it has All like the more a reason to it, or if it really does just. Is it just straight up frog glide? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Um. Hold on. I was like. That's, that's, <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh, that's hype. It's too bright. The stage play. is too bright <laughs> for this. <laughs> yeah, it's happy story time. In midst of the like in the rave music. <laughs> that, 
that's pretty, oh, pretty that's fast there. Is Pikachu too short? Uh, wow, almost a whole minute left on the clock. That's crazy. The character development, man. Truly. Really watching players grow. Oh, wait. The Tournament's over. Throughout. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, that's it. It's, oh, my God. We're, we we did it, everybody. Whoa. That was actually faster than expected. Yeah, only 40 minutes. It's actually only been 30 minutes. We're, like, on the nose. Whoa. It's like 30 minutes and 15 seconds now. All right. Good oh, job. Incredible. Playing out the clock. So if anyone if anyone made a, a bet with Sensei if, if it would go past 12, uh, you won that bet. Or Sensei lost that bet, which is more important. Yes. God. Maybe next week if Caleb joins. <laughs> What a grand final. My god, congrats. Uh, Caleb, there we go. Oh, boom, congrats. 